Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for around the 5th. Keep in mind that the timing is fluid, right? It is, because there are no clocks. And this reading may or may not be for you. Let's just see what comes up. What do we have for a message? What kind of message do I need to deliver today? What do we got? What do we have? Some sort of test. Some sort of quiet test. Ooh, Ace of Pentacles reverse. It could be a loss. You see how it jumped? So it's like a, a sudden. So there could be a sudden loss. A loss of stability. A loss of, of uh, security. This could be a loss of money. Um, something being taken away. All right. Um, a loss of a job. I just have to be honest. The Ace of Pentacles reverse is, is a loss of something. And it's something that you can't hang on to anymore. Okay. So we got a loss right off the bat. That's what that is. I mean, I can't pretend that it's not. I'm sure that there is somebody that could. But I am not that person. So anyway. Somebody did not plan effectively. Or something like that. King of Swords reversed. King of Swords reversed. Now this is somebody that is not very logical. Didn't put in a lot of effort or something like that with the King of Pentacles reversed. Oh, did I say Pentacles? I meant to say Swords. But Pentacles, I said it for a reason. So this person made some poor financial decisions. That's why I said Pentacles. Poor, poor decision making. Not practical, not logical. This is somebody who doesn't care. This is a cold, cold individual who doesn't care. You know, when you don't care, well. When you don't care, other people don't care. Hmm. Could be dealing with a Leo, could be dealing with a, a Libra, Gemini, or an Aquarius. But this is a this is weakness. This could also be a coward. You could have a coward, somebody that is cowardly, somebody that has a lot of pride, has a big ego. This person is weak. They may be ill. Could even be mentally ill. Mentally ill. We could have, you know, whatever this is, we do have a loss here. Now, the Seven of Wands reversed. This is a need to protect, a need to defend, or feeling that need. Somebody may be getting some sort of wake up call, an awakening. It's the cold, hard truth. This is the cold, hard truth. So somebody is about to get the cold, hard truth, and it's probably going to make them feel sick. Okay, that's what it looks like to me. Because this is sickness. Poor health. Going to be a loss of stability, insecure. Maybe this person isn't stable. This person isn't secure. And this doesn't have to be a person. Well, there's an energy here. There's obviously a person that this is involving. We have somebody here that... Is very prideful. Page of there's definitely a loss. There's a door that is closing. This is a dead end. There's definitely no stability. Somebody lost their focus. They lost. They couldn't master their emotions. They were too controlling. Whew. Very uncaring and cold and unloving. There's no love in these cards. None. This person was focused on the wrong thing, got distracted very easily, didn't follow through. Therefore, now they're experiencing a loss. Somebody that didn't follow through with their plan. We got some cold, hard truth that is being delivered. This is being judged. Somebody may feel like they are being attacked. 
This is this is a dead end. This is a dead end. Page of Pentacles reverse is a dead end, and this is a dead end. So something is coming to an end. This is the death of an idea or a person. It's time to retreat or take a break. Now this is we get the three of swords here. That's that's painful. We got a painful. We have a painful ending here. We do. This it's like the power is down here. But there's a painful ending. So and this is the the truth. Okay. So there's some sort of something is coming to an end. I think it's it, it is painful. There's a loss here, a, a loss of somebody's losing their job or they're losing something that they were hanging on to pridefully. They, their pride, their pride, something to do with their pride. But they're very unstable, very insecure. They're not practical at all. They don't work very hard. They may have a chip on their shoulder. This person is cold, abusive. This is abuse. But we do have some cold, hard truth that is going to be delivered. And this person, somebody may feel like they are under attack. There is definite illness here. This is illness. And this is, we definitely have some sort of illness here. And it could be mentally ill. Okay, just saying. We do have some illness here. Somebody may need to go to rehab. They may need to go to some sort of um, place to recover. A recovery period may be needed. There could be children leaving the home. The Ten of Cups reversed. This is children leaving home or a child leaving the, or a dying dream or a relationship that is coming to an end. There's relationship problems and that's coming to, this is a dead end. This is an end. Somebody is mentally exhausted. Seven of getting caught. Like I said, the cold hard truth. Some sort of truth is going to come out. Somebody's going to get caught and they're going to get caught lying. Whatever they've been hiding is going to come out. And that is what is happening here. The truth. They're gonna, some, some, some sort of truth is coming out. Somebody thought they were going to get away with something, but they are not. They are not. It does have to do with a relationship that is not stable, obviously. This page of pentacles. We got somebody here that lacks integrity. Both of these cards. This person don't have no integrity. And it's like they've been blocking something. Blocking, blocking. What are they doing? They're blocking. Somebody definitely has not planned. They, they, what are they blocking? Abundance. They're blocking abundance. This person, this person has, I, I was going to clarify, what are they blocking? This person has a self-image problem. They do. And they're blocking their own abundance, probably because either they don't want to be by themselves or something like that, because this is a card of independence. They don't want to do it by themselves. Something Somebody's going to be going their own way. Somebody's going to be getting some bad news. This is bad news. Somebody's probably going to become single. If you are not single, you could be, be becoming single. Just saying. You're on your own, honey. That kind of thing. And, and this person is very capable of taking care of themselves. Very self-sufficient. This could be the person that is is getting this this other person's job or whatever they lose it's like they're giving it to this person who is very capable very self-sufficient doesn't need anybody follows through builds themselves has proven themselves this person is abundant this person is enjoying life isn't worried about nothing interesting this is bad news, though. The Page of Wands reverse. This is somebody getting bad news.
somebody is going to receive a message. Could ha be in, re in regards to a child. This is a child. This is a child. Could be children. It's funny. I saw children because there's a couple children over here. Is there children? It usually is in the Ten of Cups. Those, I don't know if that's mother and daughter or what. Anyhow, this is a relationship, the Ten of Cups. These are children. Pages are children. So we do have a couple of children. They're both reversed though. So this is unhealthy. This person can't focus. There's no, there's a lack of focus. There's a, there's a lack of growth. There's a loss of something and it's not good news. Somebody's pride has gotten in the way of their abundance. Can't be walking around with a chip on your shoulder. Anyhow, um, the cold hard truth is somebody's going to get caught in their lies and somebody's going to receive bad news. unwelcome news and it's going to cause pain it is going to cause pain somebody's going to be really dissatisfied with whatever they hear very dissatisfied it's like this is this is definitely nine of clubs reverse ten of clubs reverse this is definitely not what you want to hear. Somebody deaf. This is very arrogant. We have a. This is too. We have a very arrogant individual here who is about to get a wake up call because their lies are going to come out. Their truth is going to be revealed. Whatever they have been thinking that they are getting away with, ha. Joke's on you. This is, this is, this is like not, it's not good. It's definitely not good. There's a lack of abundance. There's, there is over here. There's a lack of abundance. There's a lack of ha emotional fulfillment. There's a lack of emotional growth. There's no emotional, uh, there's no happiness here. And there's going to be somebody that is starting over from scratch. This is starting over. This is this is leaving that leaving something behind. Traveling to a new destination. It's time to fly. It's stepping over that edge into unknown territory. Leaving everything behind, going their own way, starting over. So somebody, this is a new beginning. So we do have, I mean, the Four of Swords, that is the, that is the death of an idea or person. So that is. There is, and this is a, this is a relationship. This is the Ten of Cups reverse relationship. Something is ending. Somebody may have acted foolishly out of arrogance and pride and now they're it's like now you're on your own this is the beginning of a new journey it is the fool is great the fool is a good card the beginning of a new journey after being lied to after getting caught after waking up, after receiving the news, somebody's going to be receiving unwelcome news. And this is going to be the cold hard truth that wakes them up and sends them packing. Somebody's going to be packing. That's the truth too. On one hand, there's going to be unfinished business. Somebody saying goodbye without saying goodbye. Either way, we have a major completion here. One phase, one cycle is coming to an end for good.
It's over. For good. Somebody is literally traveling to a new destination and they're leaving everything else behind. And they may be doing so without saying goodbye. We do have a new beginning here though. Starting over with a clean slate. Consider this a fresh new start. That's what this is. So there's a loss, and it's a big one. It is. That is teaching somebody a life lesson and giving them the opportunity to start over from scratch. Good luck.